if you could use a great show to watch this summer, guess what? We've got some ideas for you. Hulu has something probably for everybody. There are lots of new movies and premieres and shows coming up, and uh, we're going to go over a few of them right now with our friend joining us from Los Angeles, uh, two-time Emmy Award-winning journalist Kelly L. Carter. What's up, Kelly? How are you, girl? Hey, JJ, I'm doing well. How are you? I am really good. I am so glad that you have become our point person for Hulu because I think a lot of people um, have kind of joined on the Hulu bandwagon just in the last year or two and are kind of looking for those new hot movies and series coming up. Um, the Princess is something that, that folks should look out for this summer. Absolutely. Look, it premiered earlier this month in July and it follows a gorgeous, strong-willed princess who, are you ready for this, JJ? Yeah. Refuses to wed a cruel sociopath. That woman is everyone in my group chat because none of us want to marry <laughs> a cruel sociopath too. So she breaks free and you get to follow her on this journey because she's She's women everywhere, you know. She's she's women everywhere. <laughs> hey, you know what? I don't even though it's not set in 2022, it could be. Yeah, I tell you. Well, in, in 2022, it's a, it's a great time to uh, celebrate independent, free-thinking women. Yeah, it's kind of a trend right now, as a matter of fact. Uh, hey, there's <laughs> another project I was looking at that looks really fun. Yeah, uh, Bob's Burgers movie. This looks so fun. So it's animated, correct? But what I love about this is there's some great voices. It's animated. Yeah, some great people involved in this project. And I know it all kind of centers around um, this story where there's a sinkhole that kind of happens right in front of someone's business and kind of throws everything off. Yes, yes, exactly. And you know what? If you're a fan of that animated series, and I think there are a lot of people who are fans of that animated series, you are going to love what they do with this film. I mean, it, it's an extension of, of what people have come to know and love, but also it's just really like great escapism, I think, at its best. You know what I mean? Like, especially if you're looking for a departure from, from the world that exists outside of our homes. This is the movie that you want to watch this summer because it's fun, it's funny, and you can watch it while eating a burger at home and nobody is going to complain about it at the movie theater because you're on your couch at home. So, yeah, yeah, it's kind of one of those shows that looks like it's just, um, you know, it's something light and fun and Zach Galifianakis is in it. So if you like him, you're going to love it too. Uh, moving on to something a little, a little more serious with a little more weight. Uh, there's a project called Aftershock. Aftershock is probably uh, one of my favorite offerings, I think, this, this season, this summer. This film premiered, it's a documentary, and mm -hmm. it premiered at Sundance Film Festival earlier this year, and it cleaned up. You know, it won the, the Special Jury Award for Impact for Change, as it should have, because this is a film that follows two women who die in childbirth. Both of their deaths were preventable, and what happens in the aftermath of their deaths is that the families activate and really join this justice movement with maternal health and, and get involved because they obviously they want to prevent this from happening with other people. And to me, this film is very timely considering that just about every headline that we're reading right now in every newspaper around the country deals with women's bodies. So it's part of that conversation, you know, as well. And I think that um, that it's something that, that you know, you, you want to learn more about if you're unfamiliar with what's happening to a community of women who are just trying to become mothers. Yeah, it, it is a little, a little more on the heavier side for sure, but what's important about it is it's telling real life stories. Mm -hmm. And so it's like, let's look at the individual people out there that are being affected by uh, these great large decisions that are happening right now in our country. Um, Prey, again, we have just about 30 seconds, but I love this beautiful young woman who's uh, the center of this story uh, on Prey. Yes, she's a fierce and highly skilled warrior, and spoiler alert, there's an absolutely terrifying showdown. Prey is an extension of the Predator film fan franchise. You have to wait until August 5th to watch mm. that on Hulu, but it is worth the wait, even if you're a fraidy cat, just like me. <laughs> <laughs> for sure, and you can uh, log on right now and watch um, a little preview, a little trailer for Prey if you're interested. So many great movie options this summer. Thank you so much for joining us uh, to share all the great things on Hulu.
Thanks for having me. I really appreciate it. All right, sweetie. Take care. Remember, you can stream them all on Hulu, guys. If you want to watch this segment again to hear about those four projects that are happening, just head to LasVegasMorningBlend.com.